Queen intervened with Prince Louis's name, and he nearly had a different title. Kate Middleton and Prince William named the third child Louis Arthur Charles, but a part of his title was up in the air years before he was ever born. The Duke and Duchess of Cambridge made royal fans wait four days before announcing the name of their third child, Louis Arthur Charles. As he has a royal title, he doesn't have a surname and will instead be formally known as His Royal Highness Prince Louis of Cambridge. But he wasn't technically meant to have his title, and he was only handed it because his great granny, the Queen, stepped in. Louis is a traditional royal name and has long been associated with French kings. However, it's likely that Prince William and Kate picked it in tribute to someone closer to home, Lord Louis Mountbatten. Prince Philip's uncle was a close confidante of Louis's grandfather, Prince Charles, and supported him throughout some of the more challenging parts of his life. But it's the prince bit that the Queen intervened with, overriding a rule put in place by King George V, reports the Express. Back in 1917, he set out new guidance on which warriors were allowed to have titles and who was too far down the line of succession. He decided that all of the sovereign's children would automatically become a prince or princess, as well as any grandchildren born through the male line. However, great-grandchildren weren't included on the list. This caused a bit of an issue when Prince George was born, as despite being our future king, he shouldn't have had the title. The Queen stepped in and said that George would get a title, but she didn't stop there and decided to extend the change to all of Kate and William's children. This means that even though Charlotte and Louis, who are further down in the line of the successions and are like unlikely to ever sit on the throne, are also a prince and princess. If the monarch didn't make the change, it's likely that Louis would have been Master Louis Cambridge or Master Louis Windsor instead. In contrast, Meghan Markle and Prince Harry reportedly decided against giving their son Archie an HRH title. Even though he's seven in life to the throne at the moment, he will drop down considerably when George, Charlotte, and Louis have children of their own. Not having a title isn't necessarily a bad thing, and it means they have a lot more freedom as they grow older.